Hi, in this tutorial I will show you how to create 3 strand braid combo with 3D split braid and stacked braid. This is my hairstyle EXO. In this channel I will show you lots of different braids and hairstyles. Hopefully you will like it. Beginning by creating the part line for the accent braid. You need the small slice of hair from the front until the top of the head. More bigger braid you like, the more wider the section must be. Then beginning the braid, take a small section of hair from the front and separate the section in three pieces. Start to braid three strand braid, adding hair from the both sides of the braid. Right under Add hair, left under, add hair, right under, add hair, left under, add hair, right under, add hair. Right Keep on repeating this pattern until you've braided the whole section into this braid. Continue the braid until the last addings, until the braid reaches on the neck. Next, create the middle part line to the back, beginning behind the accent braid. Secure the another side of the hair with the bubble. Next, I beginning the split 3D braid. Take a section of hair and separate the section in three pieces. Beginning the braid like a Dutch braid. Left under. Right under, left under. After the first stitches, beginning to split the outmost section. Split the right section in two eagle pieces and pull the middle strand to the right side. Then add hair to the middle strand. Split then the leftmost section. Pull the middle strand between these strands and then add some hair to the middle strand. Split the right section, pull the middle strand to the right side and add hair to the strand you move just to the middle. Then split the left section, pull the middle strand to the left side and add hair from the left side to the middle. Split the right section, pull the middle strand to the right side and add hair from the right side to the middle. Split the left section, pull the middle strand to the left side and add hair from the left to the middle strand. Split the right section in two, pull the middle strand to the right and add hair to the middle strand. Split the left strand, pull the middle strand to the left side and add hair to the middle strand. Notice that you add hair every time under the strands. This braid is pretty easy to create as it includes only three strands. But as you need to pull the middle strand to the side, the braid will getting easily pretty loose. So if you want your braid tight, make sure that you tighten the strand every time before you move it. To get more volume for this braid, you can pancake the braid. I pancake only the bottom sections, so the top piece will stay untouchable. You can pancake the bolt or not pancake at all, just as you like. 
Continue the prayer until it reaches on the same place as the accent prayed. Repeat the same prayer to the another side as well. Now I have two similar prays and one accent pray on the middle. Next, I remove the elastics from the splitted 3D prays. Now I merge these two prays. Take the rightmost strands from the both prays and put them together. Then find middle prays from the both prays and put them together. Then you have only left strands from the both prays and make them one strand. Then I prayed one stitch from both sides, bringing side strand under to the middle. Then I take small section of hair from the middle strand and leave it out of the braid. This is for the second braid. Continue braiding the three strand braid, bring the strand from side under to the middle, then from the another side under to the middle. And again, under to the middle. Create four to six stitches like this, and then leave the another section of hair for the stacked braid. After this, continue braiding until the end of the hair. To get more volume for the braid. Pancake the edges. Pull only the outside edge out of the braid, leaving the middle part untouchable so the braid will stay nicely on its shape. Next, I work with accent braid. You can see it comes under the braids and it won't be sticky anyway. Release the elastic and pull the accent braid through the braid after the merging point. Be gentle so the braid won't ravel. Then just continue braiding the accent braid. Bring the strand every time under the middle and add hair from the places where you left it out from the bigger Dutch braid below. Continue the braiding until the braid is on the same length as the Dutch braid under that one. Secure the topmost braid together with the bottom one. And here's the final result of this hairstyle. Thank you for watching this tutorial, hopefully you like it. Have a great day!